Hi, my name is Adam Sloan and I'm a family law attorney here at O'Connor Family Law. Today, I'd like to talk to you about how you can save some money on your legal fees. Be on your best behavior. Now, what does this mean? It means don't yell and scream at the opposing party. Don't send inappropriate text messages or emails. When you send a message to the opposing party on your case, write it like you're sending it to your boss. Write it so that if and when it is brought up in a court proceeding, the judge will look at it and not make a negative interpretation about you from that message. However, you do need to toe a line here because you don't want to look like you're writing something to purposely entrap the other party. You don't want to write something that the judge is going to look at and think, oh, this was purposely written for a court proceeding. This person deliberately wrote this just for the purpose of me, the judge, seeing it and drawing a positive inference. You don't want that. You just want it to be a normal, neutral, objective communication that is appropriate. Same thing goes with dating. If you're going to date when you're in the midst of a divorce or a child custody proceeding, that's up to you. But don't throw it in the other person's face. Don't be overly aggressive about it. You don't want the other party's feelings to be hurt during this process because hurt feelings mean contentious court proceedings. Contentious court proceedings mean extended, expensive litigation. It means trial, not settlement. And what trial means is more legal fees. Settlement means affordable, short. So if you are going to date, keep it off social media. I really hope you enjoyed listening to my advice today on how to save legal fees, because not only does this save you money, but it also makes our job easier.